We are walking to the town of McCarthy from where we're camping, which is on the other side of the footbridge. There's a footbridge that crosses the river. It's a pretty big and fast river. That's almost completely glacial torrents from the two huge glaciers that are upstream. The Kennecott Glacier and the Root Glacier. They kind of merge. I think one is significantly bigger than the other one. And when they merge, one just kind of takes over. We're gonna hike to one today. But before that, we're gonna, we're gonna walk the six-tenth of a mile to the town of McCarthy from where we're camping because only locals who pay the $300 a year fee get to use um, the other bridge that, ca that cars can drive across. Or you take shuttles like that if you want. We'll take that up to Kennecott Mine, which is where you start hiking to the glacier. But for now, we are going into the town and getting some breakfast. There's uh, basically two places to eat. An old food truck that no longer moves called the Potato, which is what we're going. Or there is a saloon, the Golden, the new Golden Saloon that has food and beers, of course. So, we're heading to the potato. We're with the whole crew. Kids, Angela, Jason, her son Bodhi, and our three kids, Marlene, of course, and me. We're probably gonna be heading out of Alaska by the beginning of next week. The only place left for us to see that we haven't seen yet is Valdez, that we plan to see. All the other places have been checked off of our list, more or less. We should could have gone to some other more remote places, but we're just not capable to set up to do that with our trailer. McCarthy's pretty remote. That's about as far as we can go. I caught up. Here's the potato. Hey, how'd you end up behind me? I stopped in the museum. Oh, it's open? Huh? I didn't know that. Anything good? Sweet. They look like a baseball player. Daddy, can I get orange soda? Hey, chicken. Salmon burger. It looks pretty good. Yeah. Just an espresso with water, right? That's a long one, like a snake. No, 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 I bounded the snake. You bite the snake in two. In three. Do, do I get nothing? Got you french fries, Aka Sherman. French fries coming, Luca. No. This is the potato head. I'm guessing. Potato head is what they're known for. First item on the menu. They were like all out of all the hot sauce up there. There's like 10 different bottles. They're all out. We're gonna see if we can rent crampons. Worst name ever. From this place, McCarthy Air. And they rent gear. Well, glacier hikes. Crampons are those things that you put over your shoes that have metal spikes so you can walk on glaciers and ice. See if they have them here and how much. Luke still has this. So are we doing like multiple? Yeah, those guys. Two groups. Okay, so two.
the only ones that are different from all the rest of those. These are a longer bar. And there's a lift. Actually, yeah. If you guys want to come in here real quick, I'll just go through a brief rundown on these. So there's a left and a right. Kind of hard to tell sometimes with these. There's just ever so slight little curve. Um, the other ones are a little more obvious. But to adjust them, this plate here has a pin in it. You pull mm -hmm. that back and you slide it mm -hmm. up and down. Um, the ones that you guys all have are the same length and they're good up pretty much up to size 11 um from i think like six or so uh so these ones just have a longer set for bigger shoe and then, so this is the right just actually want to try this on real quick oh, all right go ahead one more time we go There we go. See, that's yeah, snug yeah. in there, and then they're pretty straightforward. <coughs> buckle, buckle. Um, most have this little hook right there that goes into a leaf. For those, um, you know, it's not gonna hook in anything, but um, that's what that's there for. And it just kind of helps keep that strap lower around your foot. Other than that, um, heel strike when you're walking with these. Okay. If you tend to walk on your toes, occasionally you'll catch fall down but uh yeah, and that just keep your feet extra wide um otherwise it's easy to catch okay and yeah short steps lift your feet don't fall you know how to walk are they so we're on the two mile hike to the bottom of root glacier we took a uh, $5 shuttle from the town of McCarthy. <coughs> Drops you off at Kennecott. That's a shuttle frequency that they use to talk to each other. I got my radio tuned into that so I can listen. And if we had a call for help, I can communicate with them. So same shuttle that we took yesterday to go to Kennecott. We took that, we ran us some crampons from the Adventure McCarthy Air store. Rip off, man. Crampons are 20 bucks to rent, 15 bucks for kids. If you go to Amazon, for 20 bucks, you can get your own crampons shipped to your house with Amazon Prime. But of course, what are you going to use crampons for? Are you really going to bring them with you if you fly? So, if we're going to go on any other glaciers, we're going to be down in Amazon Prime range. Definitely buy some for yourself. You can probably buy them, bring it up, and then sell them to somebody. You know? Why not? Everything's expensive up here, but it's going to allow us to go on the ice, which will be really awesome. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! I'm falling! Look out there! Don't fall down there! We're really close to the glacier. There's a waterfall where we're going to drink the water. Thank you, baby. Cheers. It really turned out to be an awesome day for this hike. Weather cleared up. You can see clear to probably where we're camping. Of course, you gotta be high enough in the glacier to do that, but.
pretty much all the mountains with a little bit of cloud on top. See for miles. Visibility is probably, those mountains are probably 50, 60 miles away. It's awesome. Hey, go. That's a mini avalanche. Crampons. These are hard to walk in on rocks. They are, they need to. So, don't walk on your toes. Okay. If you walk on your toes, you're, you're likely to fall over on your face. Pretty crazy. Sounds crunchy. Over here is a good practicing spot. No cracks. Don't step on the cracks or you fall into the cracks. I'm trying to fast. Hold on. A lot of This is totally worth renting the crampons for. Oh, yeah. I mean, if you came out here and that's all you got to do at the bottom, you got to do this. Lake, a little lake in the middle of the glacier. And there's some river action going on over here, which is pretty cool. little meandering creek. I'm sure there's tons more of it that up that way. But we're good. We're happy with what we got today. Walking on ice. Huge giant piece of ice. So awesome. And while we're coming up here I did a uh, periscope for the first time. I don't know. <clears throat> I've never done periscope before. We have an account. It's, uh, if you don't know what periscope is, it's like Instagram but with live video. <coughs> and it's uh, part of Twitter, something Twitter made. And it's pretty cool. Uh, I've watched other people periscope, I've never done it. But I got on, somebody saw, <coughs> and they shared it with a bunch of people. So we had a couple hundred people watch my scope for the first like 20 minutes coming up this glacier, which I thought that was pretty cool. Really interesting. Well, it's a big crevasse, be careful. Yeah, that is. That is the that is the stuff you have to be careful of. Good lord. Look at that. I don't know how deep that goes. Looks like somebody looks like somebody dug a hole right here with a thing, huh? We're walking back. Walking back to base camp after a day of hiking on the glacier, hiking to the glacier, and then hiking on the glacier, and then trying to avoid falling into crevasses, taking pictures on the glacier, 
it was pretty awesome. And then we took uh, the five mile shuttle down from the glacier, from Kennecott to McCarthy. Okay, hold on. Don't get run over. And uh, ate dinner at the Golden Saloon, which is delicious. It was really good. Portions, not so great. Prices, eh. You know, we thought they were good for Alaska, but tonight we paid 110 bucks for the five of us and we didn't have enough food. Well, we had enough. We didn't gorge ourselves. We probably had the right amount of food, but, right, that's, that's a little high for a restaurant, but probably probably about right for Alaska. You gonna do anything? You gonna do anything tomorrow? Anyways. Wanna go in the river? It was cool. Uh, your family would be so much fun out there. <laughs> you mean like a like a rapid, like on a boat? Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's not too rapidy. We just start on the lake here at the corner, yeah. and then we go down. It's, um, it's got some rapids, but they're all pretty. You know, oh, we. Kids. We see the guys come down. We're just past the footbridge. Yeah, that's the toughest rapids there are right at the beginning, and then it kind of mellows out. It there. gets cold yeah. when the water goes on the you. The GoPro would be perfect for it. The GoPro. You get some awesome shots. I think I'm getting awesome shots of other people getting wet. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're actually leaving tomorrow. Cool. Well, have you had a good so, time? Yeah, I love it. We we'll nice. spend five nights here, I think. Woo! Five or six. So. Awesome. Hey, hi. Hello. You want to promote? Your company? McCarthy River Tours. McCarthy River Tours. Alaska. Come probably, over, uh, come ride the rivers with us. Probably running, dwindling down for the season. Oh, right? we've still got about another uh, couple weeks of good flows and okay. then we'll start selling things down. But right. yeah, the fall colors come out. It's beautiful out here. We'll get some snow on the mountains and the yeah. rivers will still be It is beautiful strong. here. I will, I will, I will uh, double down on that beautifulness. Yeah, you know it. All right, cool. Have Thank you. One. Are you shooting us? No. What are you doing to me? Shooting. Shooting me. Wait, splinters in the back. No. No splinters? This, this, this is my sword. Oh, it's a ninja sword. Oh, yeah. Ninja, hey. ninja sword. There he goes. How does he figure that out? I don't know. Look at these mountains. I don't know if you can see those mountains from here light on it, the snow on it, the glacier, that's the glacier right there, that's the glacier we went on today. We didn't go obviously that high, but it's all one big continuous piece of ice. So cool. God, what an awesome day.